I've never been this close to it, any animal this big. And the fact that I'm about to get over the fence and go inside is uh, making me slightly apprehensive, I have to say. I've got to show you something pretty special here. This is a fantastic story of a rhino, a black rhino male, yep. who's actually completely blind. He got into a brawl, smacked his head against another rhino, and uh, his uh, retina was detached in the one eye. The other eye gradually went as well. So it's really rare, a rare black rhino species called Bicornis bicornis. Mm -hmm. And the idea is that, you know, every rhino matters. He looks happy. He's very happy, yeah? He's got good weight. Yeah. Funny enough, if you stand in his enclosure here, yeah, the, the darkened off area, yeah. there's a permanent uh, streaming of a radio station that he loves. What music does he like? <laughs> Hard rock. Is it? <laughs> Heavy metal. I'm six foot one. He must be a good five foot eight, five foot nine. Yeah, he's, he's pro yeah, he's probably right about there. He's a, he's a big boy. In the wild, a black rhino like this would be so dangerous. I've heard so many stories about how aggressive they are. I've never been this close to a, any animal this big. And the fact that I'm about to get over the fence and go inside is uh, making me slightly apprehensive, I have to say. Good boy. feel very different on this side of the fence than that side of the fence. Why, why does he drag his feet like that? He's now marking his territory a bit. OK. It's not an aggressive thing, that? No, that's mm. marking his territory a little bit there. Now, what happens with the territorial bull is he'll, he'll poo and then he'll stomp it all around. And that mm. means I'm the big boy here. And other youngsters will just poo and they won't mess it like that. And that's their way of like bowing down to his supremacy. I see. I thought that was his yes, pre-charging yes. pre ritual. No. It's extraordinary, really. In the wild, that would be something that I would go out of my way to avoid. And clearly it is a little bit different because he's blind, but... Um, in any of my sort of survival, uh, experiments where I've been in the wild, I would not have wanted to come close to one of those.